What's up guys, Random iPhone here. I'm gonna show you my top 10 Cydia apps. Starting with the uh, Google Android lock. This is a real good lock. It replaces the normal number lock with the uh, Google Android phone. What you do is you have to draw a line. You can change this in the settings. Draw a line and it unlocks your phone. Just like that. Next is I blacklist. What this does is it blocks people from spamming you with SMS or calls. You can just block them completely by going into here, blacklist, and you add your contact or the number that's blocking you. I mean that's annoying you. By doing that, okay. Next is I protect. What this does is it puts a code on any app that you want, on any application, any anything you want. Like you can put it on all the applications or just some of them that you can choose. So I have it on my Safari, Cydia, and phone. Okay. Next is. Um, I real, I real quick SMS. What this does is it lets you send a message from where whatever you're doing. Like at the moment, I have Tetris on. What I can do is click the volume button, and that comes up. Tap for quick SMS, quick send. Ah, just tap it and comes up you can just call someone type their name I mean their number or contact and click on call it'll call or go into message and send a message that's pretty useful okay next is winterboard what winterboard is it lets you put themes on your iPhone or like I have here, volume boost, SMS sounds, and some wallpapers that you download off city. That's um, something that you have to have on your phone or iPod. Next is going to be spoof or poof, poof, sorry. What this does is it makes your an application icon disappear instead of deleting it you can make it reappear then click the app store right here just click on off it'll do this it'll respring your iPhone just a sec And there you go, there's no um, app store or whatever I deleted. Well, I didn't delete it, you just remove the icon, it's gone there. Okay, next. Stars is a must have. It downloads anything from the app store for free. Just go into your settings, change the home URL to App Tracker. I have App Tracker because Apollo dot US is not working at the moment. And here you have all the apps: books, games, entertainment, sport, anything you want. It's in here for free. Okay, next is S B Settings. Just slide on top here. Slide your finger across stick and this pops up what it does is it has these little icons here 3g respring bluetooth brightness anything you want you can access this from anywhere it's pretty useful turns your wi-fi on 3g on or off 
it's really useful. Okay, next is this icons. I have 28 icons on one page instead of the regular um 20 I think. No, not even 20, even less I think. Oh, regular 16. I have 28. It's um what's it called? Five eye rows, five eye columns and five icon duck put together, making it 30 icons on one page instead of having like a thousand pages. Okay, next is your tube. What this does is going to YouTube here. What this does is let you download any video that you want from YouTube directly from your iPhone YouTube app. Just let it load. Here. Uh, you see this little icon here? On the top right. Just click it. It has a high quality and a low quality. That's your connection. I have high quality so I'll probably choose high quality and it downloads it. And it goes into here. Downloads. Okay. Okay, the final app is side delete. What this does is it lets you delete any Cydia app without having to enter Cydia and deleting it from there. You see they're red, the red ones are Cydia apps and the black ones are just normal apps. It's pretty useful. You don't have to enter Cydia, wait for it to reload and stuff like that. And that was my top 10 Cydia apps. Hope you enjoyed it. Comment, rate and subscribe to my channel if you want to see more videos like this. Thanks.